This is huge, folks. This is huge. Remember, you've got a, a prophecy of the popes from St. Malachi, and there is to be only one more after Benedict. Have you heard? Benedict resigned. So when this next pope takes, takes over, he is the last and final and evil pope. If you thought Benedict was evil, you ain't seen nothing yet from the next pope. Benedict was uh, certainly, in my opinion, not a good pope. And if you read any of his books, uh, you might even say he was a heretic. Because there's a lot of statements he made in there that really... They weren't really good in his way of thinking about things. So let's go into this. This is... Uh, this was front page news here. Who's in line to succeed him? Well, the final pope, uh, Petrus Romanus, Peter the Roman, Pope Benedict, this is out of Paris as you can see, stunning announcement that he will resign later this month. Time may be coming for the Catholic Church to elect its first non-European leader. Could be a Latin. That region represents 42% of the world's 1.2 billion Catholic population, the largest single block in the church. European heartland is compared with 25% in it. After the poll, John Paul, a German-born Benedict, the post once reserved for Italians is now open to all. Who gets the nod depends on the profile of the new pope that the cardinals who elect him at the next conclave think will guide the church best. Two senior Vatican officials recently dropped surprisingly clear hints about possible successors. The upshot of their remarks is that the next pope could well be from Latin America. Cardinal Turson, Cardinal Dolan, and Cardinal Tagel. We'll have to see. It could be somebody not even, their picture's not even up here. Now, Tom Horn and Steve Quayle. I believe Tom Horn has a pretty good idea who, who it's going to be. He's, they've looked into some things. So if you can uh, look for some Tom Horn videos, it may be under the one uh, Petrus Romanus where him and Steve Quayle are talking about it. But this is giant. This is huge. The Pope's prophecy has, has not failed yet. Malachi has been correct on every Pope. And there are no more in his prophecy after the successor to Benedict. Remember, I've said before in prior videos discussing uh, the final pope before in Malachi's prophecy. I said Benedict was old. He wasn't going to be around that much longer. They were either going to kill him maybe or he was going to die, you know, naturally. Well, hey. This was a wild card I never thought about, res resignation. So they've got a timeline they have to play in within God's timeline. And this is their mark. This guy has to come now. And you know who comes at some point once this guy gets in. Antichrist. So, we're gonna, we're gonna find out here in a little while. He's gonna resign later this month, and then he's gonna choose. So, God be with all of us. Y'all need to 
I do too. Everybody needs to pray. Because times are going to get really different. And they're not going to be good times once this guy gets in. So find these articles, read up on them, do some thinking, cloak yourself with the armor of God, protect yourself from the evil, forge a close relationship with Jesus and His Father. And I'll speak to you all soon. I'm going to try to find some more out about this stuff. I'll bring you some more as soon as I can get some more on it.